How's it going everybody and welcome back to another video on the EK1 Gaming channel. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different and we're going to bring you a piece of software from Wutechi which is a soundboard slash voice changer slash something you need. If you want to troll your friends, you just want to have a laugh and a joke, you want to be in Discord tricking people, or you want to do open mic on Call of Duty Warzone just to troll, then this is the software you're going to want to get. We are going to put the link in the description below of today's software. I'm going to show you a few funny things and a few good things that you can do with this software. I do use this software as well, so if you do see me in Call of Duty, you probably know that I've got a voice changer. It might change my voice to a woman, it might change my voice to Darth Vader, a devil or anything basically so you can also play some funny sounds through your mic so let's take a look at today's wuteki soundbot so to download the software of course it's as easy as ever just go to the link in the description below click on the link and it will bring you to this page here and then you can go for the free download which has some limited functions you can still use it you can still use the free stuff maybe try it out and then if you do want to get like the premium version of it which i do have uh, you can see the price in here as well but i would recommend just getting the free download have a little go have a play around see what you can do have a look at the offers what they've got on as well because they always have money off on this so take a look go ahead and get it downloaded as you can see there's 500 plus voice filters on there memes and um, so you can change your voice like we said earlier to different games robots uh, all that stuff and you can also fine tune it as well which i'll show you in a little bit changing pitch and um, changing uh, all different levels and stuff like that uh, there's also 300 plus built-in sound effects so that's good if you want to do videos um, and you want to put some sound effects or funny things into stuff and then you can also um, play it like multiple ways you can use hotkeys and stuff like that for it as well um, you key bind everything Make it easy if you've got a stream deck, stream deck it. Um, and then you can import your own MP3 files. So if you do have something that you've done on a video, maybe you've um, you've shouted something or you said something or you just want something like let's go or something like that coming up, you can actually use that uh, as a hotkey or you know change it to a, a different key on your stream deck if you want that to happen at certain points. So you can also hear yourself back as well, which is good. You can turn that off as well, but we'll go through that in just a second. Go ahead to the link in the description and click download. So once you have downloaded the Wuteki soundbar, all you're going to want to do is open it up on your desktop and you'll be faced with this screen right here. Now there's a few things you can do on here, which is a voice box, soundboard, voice meme, voice studio, and some settings. The first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is of course do the settings. So go into your settings, make sure that your microphone is selected. So for me, I'm using a GoXLR, so chat mic for me, but you can use any different ones here. You can literally go through them all. And then again, your headphones or where you want the sound to come out of, again, just I leave mine on system, but pick where you want them. If you can't hear them, click detect and it will automatically do this. So keybind settings, you can click the different hotkeys to do different things. So hear yourself. So you can click it down at the bottom or you can just press the keybind. Apply voice changer and turn it off. You can click a keybind for that. And then background sound effect, you can also click a keybind for that as well. I'm just going to leave mine for now because I'm going to click them on screen for you guys today. But generally, if I'm playing, I'll either link that to some kind of stream deck or I'd link it to a button press on my keyboard. So we're going to start with the voice box. Well, what is this really? You know, what does it do? Well, it just changes your voice completely. So if we turn it on, which we're going to do now. So bear with me one second. Second. So right now, we've turned it on, and you can hear my voice has completely changed to Lolita. Lolita voice Bella. And now I'm talking normally, and for you guys on the video, you're probably going to hear me sounding like a female maybe, or a very squeaky voice. I'm not sure because I don't have it coming through my headset. You can also change it. So now I'm a man with a cold. Now some of them sound good, some of them don't sound so good, but you can fine tune each individual one so now i've got a swollen mouth i can't really talk or if you're actually wanting to sound like you're underwater or in a cave you could probably go ahead and use this here 
So what we're going to do now is obviously show you a little bit of the fine tuning and all the options that you have here. You have so many options, really. You can play around with this a lot. You can have a random beep. You can do random farts and stuff like that. You can also add your own stuff. You can look at hot stuff. So minions, Mario, mouse. You can sound like Elmo. Uh, you can change your voice from male to female. You can do a lot of different cool things when it comes to having a sound bot or a sound board. Um, now, the fine tuning really is we're going to click on the male to female because I think you'll be able to understand me um, a little bit with this. So you should right now, my, my voice should sound more feminine. And if I wanted to change that, you can change it here on the pitch. So if you can have, you can have a higher pitch. Or you can have a lower, a lower pitch. So if you want to have it just normal, put it on zero. Um, if you want the vocal length to be higher, so set the vocal, the vocal length to be like this. Or you can set it maximal, which sounds a little bit distorted. So what you would do is find a happy medium. So for me, that is just generally, uh, just going to be on number one. And your vocal width as well, you can change that. And you can also change the volume. Then you can go into fine tuning, uh, tuning even. You can go to formant. You can put that up. So I put that all the way up, which don't sound very good. And then I put it back down a little bit more, a little bit more, and maybe just no slightly more. Then the tone. If you put that down to zero, it sounds horrible. About halfway, it's not too bad. The top one here is pretty good. The mix. Put, put it, it down, down to half. half. And then you can literally just hear my voice if the mix is on zero. It will put a little twang on my voice, but really it's it's zero. It's not mixing anything in. So you want that to be at 100%. You can then go into more and select all of these options. Now we're not going to go through every single one of these options for you, but you can get the point. You can change pretty much anything when it comes to it. If it has, a, if it's a sound effect and it has like uh, music and stuff, you can edit that information as well. And you can also do the equalizer on here. Now I do want to show you some of the cool soundboard things. So it's okay changing your voice. You can search for voices. You can do a lot of things and really, you know, just just troll your friends or something in gameplay or on Discord or especially Call of Duty Warzone. You see a lot of now streamers doing this, changing their voice, um, sounding like a female or sounding like a ghost and basically just playing around with uh, with their teammates. What you can do is actually have a soundboard on here. So the soundboard is something that will make a sound on here without ba basically without really doing anything you just have to press a button and it makes a sound so we've got a fart here soundboard and it's set to number two we've key binded this to number two so if i was to press that all that's going to happen is you will basically hear it through the computer so here we go yeah. pretty simple you know we don't have to really do anything there you have a fart sound that literally comes through when I press number two. You can put this to your stream deck as well. So if you do have a stream deck and you want a whole panel's worth of just these um, noises that you can make and you can have lots of cool things, you know, you can have like wrong answer, for example. So, you know, if you're playing some fun games and you just want to have a little bit of a laugh and a joke, you can do that. You can also have the Mario death. So as you can see, it's cool, right? There's a lot of things you can do with this. You can download your own. So if you look here, like Discord, so you can have like, I don't know, laughter. Okay, so if you like to have people laugh at you, you can press that. I don't know why you'd want to do that, but you can have a lot of different things. So what we will use this for basically is in streaming and stuff like that, people will have some fun things going on. So if you donate, you might like make a different sound uh, automatic on their stream. But what they might have is something that we used to have in Outriders. I don't know if anyone remembers this, but when we got a legendary weapon drop, 
we would hit a button on the stream deck we would have an outrider come up and dance on the screen and there would be a noise uh, a sound board basically noise happening in the background like a song or whatever it was so we would utilize that within streaming a lot of people can utilize this just generally you know you can have the radar or the uav sound from warzone you can keep pressing it so everyone around you is going to hear what's coming through your mic and that's what's going to be coming through so everyone's going to think you've got unlimited uavs like constantly uavs or you can have a discord join in one where you know it, it sounds like the discord sound like da -dunk, and then it says hey guys what's going on like stuff like that you can really troll people with this board it is absolutely ridiculous i have mine set up on my uh, stream deck for when i stream i don't really stream that often anymore but i really do miss doing this and it's really really something that you can just have a laugh and a joke with and brighten people's days up with you know and really troll people as well so as long as all of this is on all you have to do basically is just activate you can choose to hear yourself so for me that puts me off a little bit i do do it for the purpose of this video so the sound comes through to you um but you can have the voice changer on hear yourself for me because i'm running through obs here i've got the voice changer where it doesn't come through when i'm talking normally but when i put here myself it will come through to you because it's going to come from my headphones to you guys so um background sound effects you can have that on and off as well so set up all of your hotkeys i really would say to set those hotkeys up and if you want to get a stream deck go ahead and get a stream deck i'll link that in the description as well if you want to get one of those they are really really fun to use so voice meme basically these are kind of like the soundboard but it will just be like you know trump stuff so let's 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 it's come straight up with trump okay so let's be uh let's just click on one of these what should we go for look let's try this, this one. there we go look at this guy, look at this guy. you know stupid. you're stupid so if you just want to troll people again, just, you know, have a bit of fun. And it's really funny. And you got Harry Potter on here as well, or Harry Potter, should I say. Um, I think that's been spelled wrong. But, um, you know, you can do a lot of stuff here. So and there we go. If you like Harry Potter, you can use that. If you want to put your own on, there are loads of websites you can use to download MP3 clips where you can in integrate those with um, this piece of software. And I'll link those in the description as well. So there's so many you can do. Of course, the ones that we have here are good, but you're probably going to want to extend your horizons. You know, you're going to want to really broaden those horizons, go out and get the ones that you really want. It might be a bit of music. Just be careful with music. If you're uh, doing it on a YouTube video or something, you might get a copyright strike. So just be very, very careful when using anything with music on. Then there's the voice studio. Now, this is where you can edit. We're not going to go through all of this today, but it's a very good function within um, the Wuteki soundbot because not many soundbots actually offer you this. So all other soundboards that I've used have not offered this much um, customization. Um, so really you can just literally change your own voice not to make it sound like something else But to add some bass if you don't have a go XLR for example like I do You can literally add pretty much anything on the go XLR is on here. So like the bass the equalizer delay Reverb high low pass high pass multiband echo, you know everything is there You know literally everything you want to do you can change just within this software as long as you've got this software open It will activate on your microphone and then again, like I say, just set those hotkeys, have some fun. Don't be scared just to try new things. And if you do see me in games and you're thinking, oh, what the hell? He sounds different or whatever. Or you see me on stream, ask me to show you some of these sounds and I'll, I'll just put them on because I have them on my stream deck, like I say. But if you do want to download this software, go ahead, use the link in the description below. It's really funny. I had so much fun with it over the years. And I mean, I've been using these things for years and years now. And I feel like a lot more people probably don't know about them. So this is one of the ones that I use. I just wanted to showcase that to everybody. So if you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Make sure you leave me a comment in the comment section below. Take care, everybody. And we'll see you in the next video.